boys and girls and welcome to Gordon Guitar 2 Feet Caviar. So this one is a bit exotic, very very cool melody here going on, very easy to play as well so that's great. So let's start right away, only three chords and no need for any capo. So the three chords we will need here is the A minor first, so that is open A, 2nd D, 2nd G, 1st B, and open E. The next chord will be D minor. So that is open D, 2nd G, 3rd B, and 1st E. And the final chord will be this variation of E7. So that is second on D string, fourth on G, third on B, and fourth on E. All right. So those are the chords. We will look at the melody first and then finish off this tutorial with the strumming. So it goes A minor, D minor, E7, E7. That is how this chord progression goes. So let's start with the A minor part. This melody sounds like this. Very, very easy. So you just play open A, second G, first B, and open E. Basically, just go down the line here from the chord A, G, B, and E. All right, one time like that. Then you shift to D minor. And what you do there, you just play exactly from the chord here, the open D string, the second G, the third B, and the first E. And that is the D minor parts. So, And then we have the final part left, and that is from the E7. The first part, the first E7, we can say, you will just play from the chord. So that will be second on D, fourth on G, third on B, and fourth on E. Okay, and you make a small break there. Then you're gonna play this again. You will play that now. So what you do there, you're gonna play still the same here. Second on D, fourth on G, third on B, fourth on E. So still the same here. Now you're gonna slide up to the fifth frets on E string. So immediately when you hit this fourth fret, you slide up to fifth and slide back again to fourth. So everything is with only one pick with your right hand. You slide up to fifth and go back to fourth. So it goes fast like that. So, so when you have slide back there to the fourth fret E string again, you'll go back up from the, in the chord again. So third on B string, fourth on G, and second on D. All right, so just repeat that E7 part here. The first round of E7 is this part. So that is second D, fourth G, third B, and fourth E. Just like that, a small break. Then you play the same there in the beginning, 2nd D, 4th G, 3rd B, and when you play the 4th E, you slide up to 5th and back to 4th, and then you play back again, 3rd B, 4th G, and 2nd D. So that is the melody. When you play the A minor, on all the other chords, the notes, you want the notes to ring out, okay? So you don't mute or take the hand away like this. Try to have it as long as possible on the chord. That gives you the sound to ring out, so. Small break, 
then D minor, small break, then the E7, break, and then, and then you go for another round. So let's go for a couple rounds. also have a strummy pattern for this one and it's uh, pretty easy you grab this a minor chord since that is the first chord and one round of the strummy will sound like this all right so that is down up down up clap up down up so down up down up clap So imagine that the clap would be a D, uh, sorry, D, a down, uh, the, then it would be just down and up four times. So down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Now instead on the third down, you add a clap there, take away the down and just continue with up, down, up. So down, up, down, up, clap, up, down. So with this chord progression, it will be one strum around for A minor, one for D minor, and two for E7. So let's go for a couple rounds, A minor one, D minor one, E7 two. So I think you get that. That was Two Feet Caviar. So good luck with this cool song here. And I hope to see you very, very soon. So stay tuned and play tuned. <laughs> 